The American woman who spent six years in a jail in Bali for the murder and dismemberment of her mother is back stateside. But that freedom was short-lived. Just as soon as Heather Mack landed in her hometown of Chicago, she was greeted by federal agents and put back behind bars. Jim Murray explains. Just hours after this video was taken, heiress Heather Mack was arrested when she landed at O'Hare Airport in Chicago today. The charge? Conspiracy to commit murder in a foreign country. Her arrest followed Heather's deportation from Bali, where she was released for good behavior after serving seven years as an accessory to murder and stuffing her mom's body into a suitcase during their vacation on the island paradise. As seen in this DailyMail.com video, Heather was accompanied by her six-year-old daughter Stella, who was born behind bars. The international journey started in Bali, then Jakarta, Seoul, South Korea, to her final destination, Chicago, where Heather grew up. I spoke to Heather's lawyer, Brian Claypool. She will likely be behind bars for at least six months until we can try to have the charges thrown out. Inside Edition has learned that the original plan was for Heather Mack and her daughter to fly from Bali to Los Angeles and then to come here to Beverly Hills, where her attorney had arranged a home for them to live in temporarily. But her lawyer says U.S. law enforcement authorities had other ideas. I get a phone call, hey, federal authorities have gotten involved, the FBI is involved. They're diverting Heather and her child, Stella, to Chicago. Heather and her daughter were accompanied on the deportation flight by the foster mom who has been raising Stella. Do you think that Stella is the real victim here? It is heartbreaking. Kia Walker is the mother of Heather Mack's boyfriend, Tommy Schaefer, who's serving 18 years for the slaying in Bali. I want custody of my granddaughter. Stella has family here. She has me. Today in federal court, Heather Mack pled not guilty. Her daughter Stella is staying with the foster mother who was caring for her while her mom was incarcerated.